StarCraft, I just transitioned into Zerg. Oh, okay. Yeah. And that was like League three legs. months ago. So. Right. Anyways, here we go, guys. Countdown has begun. Remember, I will take a two-minute break after this. Good luck. All right, everybody, welcome to Imba TV, where everything is imbalanced. We've got TT Happy Zerg facing off against Care, and Care is sitting at one point, TT Happy Zerg sitting at zero. This is the EU Craft Cup Light number 37. Thanks for joining us here at Imbalance TV, where everything is Imba. Why don't you go ahead and take it away, Jim? Well, it looks like Torre and I will take things from here then, sir. Sounds good. In the bottom right-hand corner, spawning as Orange Zerg is, oddly enough, Happy Zerg. Spawning in the top left-hand corner as Red Terran is Care. The winner of this series, which this series is the best two out of three series, it is round eight of a nine-round Craft Cup Light 37. The winner of this series will have the ignominious uh, opportunity to face Beastie QT, who's going to prove to be a very tough opponent. This, in fact, will be Beastie QT's fifth final. Happy Zerg is now up to 13 drones. So he doesn't have a major decision to make yet at this point. Now, this is a four-player map. Shakira's Plateau is a large map. And uh, the players do not know where their opponent is located. Care, once again, is electing not to build, use the supply depot as part of his wall. So uh, that means baneling busts will be a little bit harder if he walls his main base off with buildings. Torre, anything you'd like to add at this point? He made an SCV again. Oh, great. Thanks, pal. Now, notice Great A, Torre commentary right there. I'll well, tell you what. there's not much going on. So, hey, what do you have to say? Um, yes, there they're is. making yeah. workers. Yes, there is. Look, well, the decision not to build a spawning pool early, that's thats something. The decision not to use a supply depot as part of a wall, unlike 99% well, of other... Who's the one, who's the one who told me not to speculate in tactics? I'm not asking you to speculate. I'm asking you to report on what's happening. And if, and if in fact, he's up to 15 drones and has, like, 220, then he's electing not to build a spawning pool, which you could c comment on. In any event, we see an extractor and a spawning pool. The extractor coming first before the spawning pool. Yeah, so it's happy. Go ahead. Let's get serious here. This is a serious StarCraft match. Well, I'm being 100% serious, folks. In any event, the second supply depot is being placed down by Care, and a, he's pumping out grains. Now, when the spawning pool is complete, Zer Happy Zerg will have almost 100. Espen Gas. Care has now successfully scouted out his Zerg enemy with this scouting SCV. And Care has got Marines. I'll tell you what, man. This guy is so aggressive with his Marines. That's right. That's exactly and what I was thinking. His next building after a barracks is a factory. So how many guys do you know they build a you know what if they build two barracks early fine I can see them being aggressive with marines how many players are as aggressive as care is with marines when he, his next building is a factory and there it is and I'll tell you what care is sitting here in the middle of the map with these marines and he's say you know what he's saying he's saying let's get ready to rumble the thing is this high grass is sitting here he's not going to spot the zerglings the zerglings are going to go in he's not even oh just sees them at the last moment yeah, it was the, you know what, it was the Zelnaga Tower that allowed him to see them. In any event, the factory is up, the barracks is up, neither building has an add-on, and an expansion command center is underway by care. Furthermore, a starport as well. Happy Zerg's expansion has completed, he is now placing down a spine crawler. Very Boy, aggressive play by Care. Look at this micro. Holy jeez. That's for sure. Ouch. 
Oh, finally, the speed upgrade is now active, and now this Helion is in big trouble. More oh. are here, though. The Helion did die. Now, while all this was going down, Care is now up to 24 SCVs, while Happy Zerg sits at 16 drones. Happy Zerg is so paranoid of losing his, his expansion that he's not building any drones. He's building, he's building Zerglings. And we do see drones, act, oh, quite a bit of drones coming out right now. You know, but still, he is sitting way behind. He's at 18. Yeah. He only built. And we see Care is putting the orbital command. And a second and third barracks for Care. As if Care's marine micro weren't good enough, he's building a medevac. That's now, for sure. also, Happy Zergs, look at this. Happy Zergs going for lair tech on his main hatchery, and that's about 10 seconds away from completing. And Happy Zerg is admitting he's a little worried by placing up a spine crawler. Now, if we look, Zerg, Zerg basically for buildings, all they can do right now is produce speed Zerglings. Aspire, it will be completed in about 70 seconds. And basically, Happy Zerg is going to have to hang on with defending with nothing but Zerglings for the next for the next 60 seconds. Look at this: one tank, one Helion, one Marine. Very oh. aggressive. Wow. <laughs> I can't even dream of playing this good. <laughs> oh, but look! Oh, at and look th that Marine is going to try to pick off that Overlord. I love this guy, yeah, man. Yeah! Holy wow. <laughs> I think he's made a couple of fans here from this play. I tell you, when are we getting the care t-shirts, man? When are we signing up with uh, Cafe Press and selling the care t-shirts? Yeah, for sure, right? Oh, and he's going to have to pick up the, that tank, but quite yeah, aggressive play thus far. And he lost the heli on there, so that was a nice attempt. While all that's going down, though, while he's drawing all that attention, Care is now building, or is now planted down his expansion command center. Um, and what's interesting is both of his command centers have enough to produce a mule. So he's holding back those mules. I don't know why. And catch that. He just laid them down and he's going to spend that money fast. And look at all these barracks going down, folks. We do see a six barracks play here. And right now the Marines stim pack is about, well, the infantry stim pack is about five seconds away from being completed. There is no other infantry upgrade available at this point. Finally, the Happy Zerg Spire completes, so Happy Zerg can go on somewhat of an offense. Baneling Nest is completed, no Baneling Speed. We've got a combination of Zerglings and Mutalisks. Now, I'll tell you what, Happy Zerg, or Care, has done a great job of keeping Happy Zerg's drone count low. That's right. So I'm sure that Happy Zerg, you know, 11 minutes into the game, Happy Zerg doesn't have the number of units he wishes he had, but these Mutalisks will cause some problems. In fact, we got six Mutalisks in the back of... Six Mutalisks in the back of Care's base. That's going to draw some attention from him. Unfortunately, Happy Zerg didn't take advantage of that with these Zerglings. He left those Zerglings by the watchtower. And at this point, we're 11 minutes into the game. Happy Zerg sits with 40 drones mining off of two bases and four extractors. To contrast that, Care, who's moving out right now, Care is mining for, with 38 SCVs. So here we go again. And by the way, those tanks do not have siege mode, and we see three banelings are morphing, twenty zerglings, and six mutalisks. More scanning going on. More banelings morphing. Thirteen banelings. No siege tank tech. I don't know if you noticed or look, if you I'm, said that. Yeah. Yet. Yeah. Now I'm not sure what he's up to here. He's now. If he had went right into those banelings, he might have been able to handle it. For sure. Oh, but look at this. So now Happy Zerg is attempting to bolster his economy with a third hatchery. A Happy Zerg still has plenty of minerals in his main base. So does Care. Not a whole lot, but enough to keep going for the next few minutes. And we do like see can... Flyer Attack Upgrade just finishing up as well as Speed uh, Banelings. So the Banelings will be rolling and bouncing and exploding everywhere. How long away? The, How long it's away? It's just about done. One second. There it is. Okay. It's just now finished. All right. 
And we got six mutalisks flying around trying to do some form of harassment. Notice again, Happy Zerg is staying at Tier 2. Notice as well, the ground carapace level 1 is being researched. And it's interesting that Happy Zerg really likes to stay at Tier 2 a long time. And we're seeing that again. No infester pit. You know, nothing really advanced. Now, notice that uh, the, marine, the infantry is plus one attack, zero armor. And uh, you know what? I think Kara is hacking. You know what's going on? He's got 200 people sitting in his basement individually controlling every unit. <laughs> this is uh, this guy's just amazing, man. Look at this. Yeah, and here we go. Siege did just get finished up, and now Banelings rolling in after oh, those Marines. Like, right. He's dead. These Marines are going to eat up those Mutalisks, man. That's right, Good they are. Job. More Banelings are going to be needed here. Look at that, man. I'm telling you. <laughs> Look at this guy. Holy He's the madhouse here. <laughs> the Marine madhouse. Look at this. Anyway. <laughs> Just takes out that hatchery with no problem. That was amazing play with the, and Look at this. Great more play. units coming in. Goodbye. Oh. Nice failing, but it isn't going to matter. Look at this. There, down goes another Zerg base. Yep. While all this is happening, he's got two bases mining like a good thing, and that and is there it. there it is. GG is called. Care takes the win. Goes into the final matches against Beastie QT as we get a Terran victory here. So it's going to be a TVT for the end. And by the way, the autograph care t-shirts will be $79.95 at the Cafe Press website for Ender TV. But even you got to realize that treacherous bitch cannot be saved. And neither can you. We'll see about that. And when this is over...